Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. So today I have a very small thrift store haul. So I just wanted to share that with you guys. And um, I have a couple little things from the 99 cent store. So let's get started with this haul. So I picked up some movies. As you guys know, I always like to pick up my movies at the thrift store. I did pick up a couple movies. Actually, I picked up four movies at the thrift store. My daughter actually went with me one time and she bought the Avengers for me. This one was in Blu-ray and it's $3. So I don't have this one. I believe I, I think I might have bought it a while back, but I gave it to one of my boys. So that one is actually for my collection. And then um, I had gone by myself and I found another movie that's up because I have already picked one of these up. But I, the one that I bought for myself was in regular DVD. And this one is in Blu-ray, and I picked it up for my daughter. And this one is $3. And then I found this movie in a DVD, Dracula. I love this movie. It's with Keanu Reeves. It's $2. Um, and when I'm Winona Ryder. I just love this movie. You know what movie I'm looking for? Um, Interview with a Vampire. That one I love too. I haven't found that one yet. Um, I also found this movie Ghost. And it's brand new. Hasn't been opened yet. So the, And this one was $2. So I bought it for myself. My daughter really likes this movie too. So I'm just going to give it to her. Since I go to the thrift store more often than she does. So I'll just I'll, I'll be able to find it again. I'm sure of it. But I do love this movie. It's such a romantic movie. And oh, Patrick Swayze. He is so good looking. So anyways, those are my movies. Um, something really random is this little uh, leprechaun. Isn't he adorable? Look at his little hat, how long and it's really adorable. Um, he was 50 cents and I figured maybe I can either put him on my wreath or just use him as a decoration. I really don't decorate too much for St. Patrick's Day, but I do plan on doing something with him next year. So the other thing that I found was the this plate charger right here. It was a dollar, and it's from Home Goods. Normally it is. Let's see, can you guys see it right there? There you go. Normally it's two ninety nine from Home Goods, and it's really really pretty. I don't know if you guys can see. Look at how pretty it is. And so again, I got it for a dollar, and they only had two, so I picked both of them up. They're really pretty. Wish I would have found more of these, but I would pick up. I picked them up. I just picked up the two that they had. So, love that. And excuse my mess, you guys. I have a mess everywhere in this room. I'm trying to get go through my stuff, and I'm basically um, I'm purging stuff, and then I still got to put some stuff up on the shelves and stuff. So, and we're moving things around. So I have a mess in my my craft room. So I apologize if you guys see all this mess. All right, let's go with this bag now. So I found this pretty looking doll. Like, I don't know. I think she might be made out of paper mache. Very, very pretty. I love this style. I love the way this looks. Um, I, I got her for 50 cents. But the person who did her, the collection it's from... Tina Flanner collection. If you guys can see that, I'll have to look it up and see who that is. But for 50 cents, it was really pretty. I think she's missing wings or something in the back because she had like something here. But oh, sorry guys, never mind my nasty nails. But um, yeah, see how she's missing something there? I'm not sure what it is, but I don't care. She looks really pretty, so I picked her up for 50 cents. Um, I found this book here. It's Little Women. I picked it up for $1.50. It is a really old book. It is from 19... Let me see. It has it in here. So this book was copyright 1947. It's an old book. And I've and I seen this movie. I like the movie. I figured I would get the book. This is what it looks like. So when I found the book... And I saw her, I had to pick her up, I don't know, I was just like, oh, she's so cute, so I 
just goes perfect together. I saw the book and then I saw her and I was like, I gotta pick her up. <laughs> so kind of silly, but then the last thing in this bag is this frame here. It was a dollar, the frame, and it's actually a Disney frame. So I'm wondering if it's, this is for like when they had the Haunted Mansion or something, or I don't know, but this is a Disney frame. And I have those like silhouettes. I don't know if you guys know when uh, you go down Main Street, there's a little area where you go in and then they take your picture, uh, your side picture. Well, they don't take a picture, but they cut out a silhouette with uh, from your profile. I have a whole bunch of those of all my kids and then I have one where we're all together. So I'm thinking of putting that in here and keeping it in this room here. So that was a, a nice find. All right, you guys, I wanted to show you really quickly. Look, see, this is what I wanted to, to put in here. I opened it up, cleaned it, and now look. You guys see? So we got this done at Disneyland, our silhouettes. We have one with each kid by themselves, and then we have one with my husband and I, and then this one, and this is my favorite. So I like the way this frame looks. And so we I can either hang it or I could just use this to prop it down on the like that if I wanted it. I just wanted to share that with you guys. All right, I think this is the last bag. Yeah. So this is the last bag. I found this beautiful ornament. Look at this this Santa Claus it's kind of like the same material as she is and he was I believe he was 50 cents or 75 cents it doesn't have the price on there but he is so nice looking look at that I just love it I've seen similar ones like this at Hobby Lobby but yeah I, I just like that look you know like that old look all right, and the very last thing that I found at thrift store was this Wiley Coyote candle um, holder. And it has the candle in here as well. It's like a little tea light. And then it has the little um, jar here where you put the, the light, the tea light. He was 75 cents. Look at that. And he's complete. There's nothing wrong with him. My husband likes this guy a lot, so he might be putting this in his stuff. So, yeah, that's really nice. I like that. So, that was everything that I found at the thrift store. They really haven't been um, taking out a lot of stuff. I don't know. Um, I've gone a few times, and I've been kind of disappointed. They really haven't had anything good. All right, so let me show you guys the stuff that I picked up at 99 cent store. I went with my daughter to the 99 cent store. I was going to buy all this stuff, but my daughter wouldn't let me pay. She ended up buying it. So this is what she bought me at the 99 cent store. So she bought me uh, this NYX NYX lip gloss. These two right here. I'll show you guys. God, my nails look horrible. Sorry, you guys. Uh, let's see. This color is spicy. It's a, like a red color. And then this one is... This one's buttery nude. So they're, they're really pretty colors. And she tried this one on. She bought herself some too. It is a beautiful color. All right. So the other thing that I did find at 99 cent store. I found these picks of cotton. And they were 99 cents each. And I picked up five. I... I didn't want to pick up too many because I'm not sure where I'm going to put them where I'm going to put them at but I like them I thought they look really nice they're real farmhouse looking but you can also use them for like fall I guess and so I I don't know I don't know what I'm going to do with these yet but I did like them I wasn't into this look before but I don't know I just started liking this so yeah for 99 cents each stem is not bad so I, I picked up five of them. The last two items that I found at 99 cent store were these Hello Kitty seatbelt um, like covers, I guess, shoulder pads. That's what they're called. 
So you put it on your seatbelt and that way it doesn't like rub the seatbelt doesn't rub on your neck or anything like that. So I picked up these two. I was picking up one for um, Kathy, my best friend. But my daughter bought me these, so yeah. And these were the last two that they had, so I had to get them. But I was looking for the, the Hello Kitty scarves that a lot of people are hauling. I can't seem to find those. There's a few things that are on my wish list that I didn't find. But, oh well. Um, I believe that is everything I have. Actually, let me show you guys one more thing. So I went to Target. And I found two candles that I liked. This candle here is called uh, Champagne Kiss. And it says Paris. Look at how pretty they kind of look like the like the Bath and Body Works, and it smells really good. It's a two wick. God, it smells really good. And this one I believe is like ten dollars or something like that. But I scanned it. I don't know why I just scanned it, and it was ringing up at eight fifty. So eight fifty for this candle, and it's um fifteen point two ounces. So, eight fifty for a 15.2 ounce candle is not bad at all. The other one that I picked up is Passion Flower Peony. There you go. And that, again, to wick. This one smells pretty good, too. So, I, I hope they have a decent throw. But look at how pretty these candles are. They had all kinds of, uh, well, they had all different types of candles. So, maybe go check them out at Target. Um, and then just scan it underneath their little scanners because they these were ringing up 850. So yeah, happy to find those candles. So I forgot to show you guys one thing that I had picked up at the thrift store. I picked up three of these battery operated candles. They're the Mirage ones. I picked them up for five dollars each. They're brand new, and I seen these at Target and at Hobby Lobby, and they are they run about twenty-five to thirty dollars in that size. All three of them that I picked up are in that size. Anyway, um, yeah, I love them. They work great. But um, I'm doing a voiceover this because for some reason the audio did not record when I was showing you guys this, so I do apologize for that. But I picked up three of these candles for five dollars each. It is not a bad deal at all. So that is everything. I hope you enjoyed this small haul. And I hope you guys get out there and find some good stuff. And I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye.